We begin with breaking news tonight. An officer-involved shooting leads to an arrest in a teen's murder. The shooting happened in Federal Way along Southwest Campus Drive outside a Winco food store. Late today, we learned this is connected to a homicide in Auburn. The victim, a teenage boy whose body was found in the Green River last month. Callie Greenberg is live with more about today's dramatic arrest. Callie. So earlier today, about half of this Winco parking lot right here was blocked off by crime tape. That's because the suspect was parked in a car in the back end of this parking lot. Now the Valley investigative team, they're conducting that officer involved shooting investigation in this arrest. So here's video that we shot this afternoon. The sheriff's office said the 28 year old suspect was in a car in this parking lot. Now deputies have tried to arrest him in the parking lot, but he ran away just about half a block when he was confronted by additional patrols. He dropped down to his knees, put his hands up in the air. Uh, once he got down to his knees, he pulled a black handgun out of his waistband. One of the TAC 30 deputies fired a shot at the suspect. They did not hit him. Uh, at that time, the suspect then threw the gun on the ground and he was put, went down into the prone position and was arrested without incident from that point on. We've also learned a, su a second suspect in this case, 20 year old Carlos Idrajeta Vega was arrested on Tuesday. Now the prosecuting attorney's office, they tell us that he's being held on $2 million bond. His court appearance is gonna be on October 11th. A case will continue to follow. Something uh, investigators are trying to learn is how were these three, the 16 year old boy who was found killed and these two suspects connected. In Federal Way tonight, Callie Greenberg, King 5 News.